with a tree. Oh, we put the bark. Yes. <laughs> Today I'm going to teach you how to do a pour using two different canvas, using two canvases together. We are going to make it so that it goes from one end down to the other. So it kind of looks when you put up, put these on your wall, it looks like they are connected, even though there might be that little space in between. Um, it's going to be a little different. We're going to use a hair dryer to help spread the paint around. Um, I've already got my paints ready, so let's get started. Okay. Okay. So, as I said, I've already got my paints um, already made up, and I did go ahead and use some silicone into it. Um, today I am using, uh, what is this? Dark... A dark red. I don't know if you can see that right. Uh, come on. Maybe, maybe not. Um, a dark red, an admiral blue. This I got at Myers. Um, it was only 69 cents. I figured I'd give it a whirl. I've never tried this type of paint before. Um, it's a metallic gold. I've tried metallic gold, but not that brand. Um, and then also a purple, it's a wild iris. So most of these are Apple Barn. Um, I usually, I'm not really brand specific. So I just pick what colors I like. So let's get started. First we need to put a base coat on all of this. I'm pretty sure we do. If not, I'm just going to put a big base coat on where I want to, um, where my paints are gonna go. And this nozzle is being funny, so I'm going to just take it off. Give it a zigzag in the middle. All right. So now what I'm going to do just make sure this is fully stirred. There's nothing mixed. Nothing unmixed into it. I'll set this aside. And we're right in the middle. Okay. Same with the purple. purple I'm going to take oh I don't know I'm going to go right on top of it or at least try I don't think there's no right or wrong reason or right or wrong way to do this oh, it's going to be pretty I may not even add the red this looks like it's going to be cute. I'm going to go up and down with this one because I really like the gold. And I want it to come out. Okay. And with my red. Mm. Just put it in there. I'll lightly use my red. I want to 
coming out too much, but forgot to go to the edge. Okay, let's set this over here. So, <coughs> excuse me, um, with my handy dandy hair dryer, I think without getting the cord all into this, um, I'm just going to go down and up and down and just kind of do some different, um, play around with it, see how it works. Um, it's going to be a little loud, so I'm going to just um, speed this up a little bit, okay? Okay, I don't want to play with this too much more because I think if I do it um, anymore, the, the um, colors are going to get a little mixed in with each other, kind of like they've done in between right there. So I'm just going to bring it in down for a close up. And I'm really glad I brought those, uh, added the silicone into it because it looks really, really pretty. And here's it. I like how the red kind of peeked out right there too. There's some of the gold in between. So, doesn't look too shabby. Not too bad for a first timer. Hope you like this. Um, and have a great day. Thank you. Bye.